AG Squad. Welcome back to episode of Is and Worth It. So today episode we got this cool one right here and basically what this is is a cleaning set that you can use for regular stove top or glass stove top as well. And for this set they probably got a lot of different stuff inside. So I'm actually open up to show you guys what the inside looks like first. Alright so once you guys take it out, this is what the product looks like inside. So right here we do have like the cleaner and the polisher. Then use to clean off your glass stove top. You can see the one that we got right here from this brand right here. And the back right here, they probably got instruction to teach you guys how to use it. And like I mentioned, for this product, it comes with a set. So they probably got this accessory right here. So right here, they probably got the cleaning tool that you can use to clean it. And they give you guys a very good grip on top. So that way, when you guys grip it, you can clean it really easily. Whereas right here, they probably got the razor or the scraper that you can use to scrape off anything off if you guys need to. So once you guys take it out, this is what the product looks like inside. But once you guys take it out, there's a razor inside right here. They can probably use that side to actually scrape stuff as well if you guys want to. And obviously since this part right here is a razor, you definitely want to handle with care and try not to hurt yourself. And for the razor or the scraper right here, they give you guys this option right here. So that way you can loosen it or tighten based on your own preference. So that is everything that's included in the set right here. So the way how you guys use the product is actually very simple. They mentioned how you guys want to apply a little bit of this on top of your glass stove top. Once you guys apply it on, you guys want to use this part here to scrub it to make sure everything is clean. Once you guys finish that step, you guys want to get like a paper towel to buff it. So that way you can make the product shine. So that is everything that's on the product. Let me actually go test it out to see when it actually works first and then we'll come back and talk more about it in a second. All right, so see right here, we do have a glass stove top. Let's test it out and see what actually works. So first thing I'm gonna do is shake the bottle a little bit first. Once you guys do that, you guys wanna apply a little bit on here and then start using the scrubber right here to scrub it off. So let's test it out a little bit on here first. All right, so let's try a little bit and see what actually works. Alright, so let's get a piece of towel and wipe it down to see if it actually works. So I see once you guys use it, it definitely moves a lot of grease on here. If you guys notice this part right here, it's definitely much cleaner afterward. So you probably want to repeat the same step a few times and you should get rid of all the smarts on here. So let's try this part right here. Alright, let's get the piece of towel and wipe it again. Alright, so you see the product definitely does work. It got rid of a lot of grease on here. So you definitely want to repeat the same step a few times, but you can see the product definitely does work. So if you guys want to use the scraper option on here, it definitely does work. So use this part right here to scrape off anything that's on here. And the scraper part is actually really useful, especially for certain parts where you can't really clean it with the actual thing. If you guys notice some parts right here where you guys can't get rid of it, so that's where one of the scrapers come in handy. And the scraper is actually really helpful because it does get rid of it. Alright, so let's wipe it off. And we see how much cleaner it looks now after you guys use the scraper and the formula. Where for the middle part right here, I don't think you guys can really fix this, but the outer layer, you can see it looks much cleaner. What we should have done in the beginning is probably like wipe off this part right here in the beginning because right now it's kind of stained on there, so it's kind of hard to get rid of this mark right here. So no matter how much time we clean it or whatever, it's definitely going to stay on there because in the middle part right here, it's been there for a while. But definitely for the outer layer right here, you guys can still get rid of it because the heat didn't really touch directly on here on the side. But you can see the product definitely looks much cleaner after you guys use the scraper and the formula. So I'm going to finish the outer side right here, but you can see it definitely does work. Alright, so once you guys finish cleaning it, if you can see it definitely does work and it looks so much cleaner. Like the middle part right here, like I mentioned, it's hard for me to remove it because that part has been stained on there. But the outer layer right here, you can see all the grease at first, it's completely gone. So definitely when you guys use the product, you do need to use the scrubber option and the formula and the scrubber. But this is basically what the final product looks like once you guys finish using it. Alright, welcome back guys. So nice to test the button, definitely see actually does work and should work quite well. So whether you want to use this on a glass stove top or like a regular stove top, you guys can use it how you guys want to. But the way how they design this product is mainly for you guys to use it on a glass stove top. And it's also really cool how they provide you guys to raise the option so that way if you guys need to scrape anything off, you definitely have the option available. But we see from the test, the product definitely does work, which is really cool. So no matter how many burn marks you guys have on the actual product, it definitely will help you guys remove it. But that is everything that's on the bar right here. Now to the unboxing and test the product. Now to answer the question of whether or not it's actually worth it or not. So for this part right here, I would definitely have to say that it is pretty worth it if you guys want one of these. Especially if you guys have a glass induction cooktop, like the one that I saw in the video. And if you guys have a lot of different marks on there that you're gonna get rid of, then definitely getting one of these is actually really worth it. But then obviously for those of you guys who don't want or don't need one or have one of these, then obviously don't buy one and save your money for something else actually doing it. 
So that's basically everything for this video itself. If you guys like this video, make sure to smash that like button in the bottom. That would definitely help this video out. And it will definitely help with the algorithm as well to promote more videos for you guys so you guys can see more of the videos or similar videos as well. But as always, make sure to stay positive, be you, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Is It Worth It? Peace.